I remember the first time I ever saw Maradona was a 1986 World Cup. I just remember sitting there and seeing him score that unbelievable goal against England when he's run, weaving his way in and out of the defenders and then goes past Shilton and slots it in the back of the net and straight away I was out, wanting to get outside and be Maradona. Everyone knows the 1986 World Cup is the Diego Maradona World Cup. What other players can you say that about? There's not many you can say this and this guy, that was him. He won that World Cup for them really. Everyone spoke about Pele and stuff, how good he was, but we didn't really, we weren't in his era. And um, looking at what we'd had to look at, he wasn't the same type of player. This was an individual who was just ghosting past people, smaller than everybody else, but strong, quick. And I said, we were just going crazy at what he was doing. and Everyone wanted to be Maradona. As I was always the youngest out of my mates, I never got to be him normally. So I had to be one of the uh, other players that weren't as technically gifted as him. He could have gone to any club and he's gone to Napoli where they was languishing really, he wasn't, wasn't doing as well as other teams that he could have gone to. He's gone there and he's kind of almost single-handedly made other players step up, raise their games and obviously his own personal skills has enhanced everyone else's and it's become a winning formula and looking back through the years there's players who were great dribblers but weren't great passers or didn't, didn't have a great knowledge of the game. There were players that were strong and quick but weren't really skillful. He, he managed to, to merge everything together and become what he was. Oh, I'd love to, I'd love to have just train with him because you see a lot more sometimes in training with players, but just to be able to be on the same pitch as someone like that and train with him, it's like, even training out, I sit there and like, I'm screaming at the back sometimes, seeing players get sat down and, and sliding off the pitch because someone's done a bit of skill against them. And I love it, I love seeing it, as long as it hasn't happened to me. I think it's great for, for Argentinian football that um, someone who's held in such high esteem, who's looked at as a god over there through what he's done for football, um, to be given the opportunity to go into management. I think he's, he's, some, he's a talisman, he's someone that the players respect and love and, and are going to want to play for him. A player like Maradona, the personality he's got, it's such a colourful life he's got. There's always something normally that was kind of in their, in, their, in their personalities that people always clinged onto him for, that drew people into him. And sometimes that's the way it is with great athletes or people that are great in their field. There's always that element of madness or difference in what they do that people want to have interest in.